France's journey in Euro 2024 has been a roller coaster of highs and lows, characterized by unexpected twists and tactical quandaries. Didier Deschamps, the seasoned coach, finds himself navigating through a maze of strategies as his team progresses through the tournament. From the outset, France's path seemed destined for brilliance, yet they found themselves in the quarterfinals through a stroke of luck rather than dominance. The match against an underdog team highlighted their struggles to convert opportunities, despite boasting an uber-talented attacking lineup spearheaded by Kylian Mbappe. Deschamps, known for his meticulous approach, acknowledged the importance of penalty kicks in knockout stages. We have to be prepared for penalty kicks, that is the key to win, he emphasized after a tense encounter where penalties loomed large as a potential decider. As the tournament progressed, Deschamps faced mounting pressure to address France's glaring issue, the inability to score from open play. Analysts and fans alike scrutinized his tinkering with formations and player combinations, searching for the elusive formula that would unlock their attacking potential. Why are France not scoring goals from open play at Euro 2024? Pondered pundits, echoing the sentiments of many perplexed supporters. The tactical adjustments made by Deschamps aimed to strike a delicate balance between defensive solidity and offensive flair, yet the results remained inconsistent. In a candid assessment, Deschamps admitted, we need goals to just keep winning. His pragmatic stance underscored the team's pragmatic approach in tight matches, where every goal became a precious commodity. Despite the challenges, France's journey in Euro 2024 serves as a testament to resilience and adaptability in the face of adversity. As they prepare for the next phase of the tournament, Deschamps and his squad remain steadfast in their pursuit of glory, knowing that each match presents a new opportunity to showcase their true potential.